if there is one coming, they can shove it as far up their as they like. Because what does it change? It ch changed the people involved. Right over the fucking edge with an anchor attached to my ankle, right? This is this is the one that really... I was just so furious at this one because... This I'm feeling very, very angry. Um... Exploto. Sí, exploto. Vamos a ver la siguiente que es el penalti. El penalti... ま、6月まで、チャンネル登録してくれた方には氏名にレアルソシエダードの Hey fellas, exploto. Sí, exploto. Vamos a ver la siguiente que es el penalti. El penalti de uh, Amitoma. Vemos aquí en la jugada como Hoberg, el pie izquierdo de Hoberg, pisa el pie izquierdo de Mitoma. Lo vamos a ver también en, en, en una captura de pantalla. Vamos a verlo en vídeo. Mire, miremos aquí, mirad, mirad cómo lo pisa. ¿Lo veis, no? O sea, el penalti es clarísimo. Mirad cómo lo pisa. Yo, sinceramente, no entiendo cómo... Ah, en directo, ¿ves? Esto en directo no se vio. En directo no se vio. Pero, ¿hay bar? Pues tampoco. Eh, tampoco, según... O sea, supongo que el árbitro... Porque el árbitro se ha hecho todo el partido así. Todo el partido así, diciendo... No, no, no hay nada, no hay nada. You guys, I'm feeling very, very angry. Um, very cross. I'm, I'm writhing my hands. My hands are writhing. Um, so that's how I feel. Joe, how, how, how are you feeling? What's your sort of mood after what we've well what we've just seen to be coming away from that game with nothing we should have scored at least five in that game we should have had at least three penalties and yet we're walking away from it probably with another uh pgmol apology coming our way which absolutely will not be accepted because they've done it time and time again this season But if there is an apology, and I apologize, guys, because we're not past the watershed yet, but there will be swearing in this episode because we're so angry. You can understand how bloody angry we are. You know, they, they can, whatever apology they're preparing right now, if there is one coming, they can shove it as far up their as they like. Because what does it change? It ch changed the people involved. Change the people that run the air. Change the people that are on the pitch running our beautiful game. Because what does it achieve? Nothing. You can see that that ball is probably 75% on his chest and the rest of it on his sleeve. I saw another um, graphic, Tom, that said the new handball, pro handball protocol. I'm so angry I can't even talk. Um, handball protocol is, as Dan and yourself are showing, sleeve down this part of the bicep yes handball this part no and i'm just going to bring that picture up again tom where's that ball on his it's, sleeve it's clearly in the like the crooks there of where his shoulder meets so his, his torso how has var come to the conclusion that Sorry, that bro, is just... a full-on penalty how this badge this badge isn't a tottenham badge that's well, we've how got... he was actually pushed By by the Spurs player, I think it was Romero. He, he was literally pushed. Yeah, and it still doesn't hit his arm. So why is that context not taken into account? Exactly. Um, Sammy says no words express how angry I am. McAllister, you can see why it was ruled out. Maybe, uh, but Matoma pen was a joke, and a Matoma. Yeah, we haven't even come onto the bloody penalty, and uh, that's the one that's really pissed me off. By the way, let's talk about the penalty. But again, a nailed on penalty that was not given. 
Pjoiberg steps on Matoma. No penalty given. I mean, where, where do I possibly begin with this? You know, I mean, it, I, I, it, it, it left me completely speechless, to, to be brutally honest with you. Because, like, and the other two, you could, you could maybe try and find a way to maybe uh, explain why they were, were not given. Maybe. At a, a very long stretch, in my opinion. But this one, it, it, this is the one that really just sent me right over the fucking edge with an anchor attached to my ankle, right? This is, this is the one that really... I was just so furious at this one because this one, it was just the most blatant out of every single one of them, right? This was nailed on. And I was listening to the commentary, and even the commentary were like, how was that not given? How is that not given? It's like, oh, Brighton, I've got to feel aggrieved here. Aggrieved. Good argues, mate. Like, I'm sorry, I, I was furious, absolutely furious. But I'm sure, lovely Joe and wonderful Dan and yourself are going to tell, say exactly the same thing. But it's just a catalogue of errors. Just this game, it's just all, it's just ridiculous. It's just oh, I'm move on. I'm going to move on. <laughs> I I can't comprehend in what world that that isn't a penalty. I. Guarantee you. I guarantee you. It's a world you. where Brighton are in the possibility of upsetting the apple cart, as it were. Here in Brighton, they are not spending millions upon millions upon millions of pounds. こちらがブライトンの現地をサポーターの怒りでしたまた350ライクでパート3の動画もアップロードしますこちらはザさんに載っていたその記事になりますが現地のサポーターがこのように怒りを表していましたこちらが1人目のファンになります、えー、三笘の素晴らしいゴールがハンドの判定で取り消されたロメロは三笘を押したし腕というよりかは胸だったゴールでなくてもペナルティーだロメロは明らかに三笘を押した笑三笘のゴールは成立するはずだった。三笘のハンドはありえない。完璧に取られたゴールだ。VAR は混乱している。そして最後には、八百長だというコメントもありました。皆さんはこの試合についてどう思いますか八百長だったと思いますかそれとも、イングランドの主審はレベルに値していないと思いますかコメント欄に意見を教えていただければと思います。では今回の動画はここまでになりますが、いつも通りチャンネル登録と高評価をよろしくお願いいたします。毎日のように新しいコンテンツをアップロードしますので、通知をオンにしていただければ、その新しいコンテンツを見逃すことはないです。